Hey, hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to you. Five Minute Eats and today we have got another ginger beverage review for you. We have got a whole ginger ale, ginger beer playlist. We've reviewed a lot of them. A lot of them are bad and some of them are really good. We're gonna find out how this one stacks up. It is the Olipop Ginger Ale, a new kind of soda, supports digestive health with prebiotics, botanicals, and plant fiber, non-GMO, five grams of sugar per can, 12 fluid ounces, and it's only 50 calories and has 14% juice. Now, this has a whole lot of like very, abnormal ingredients <laughs> to find in a soda. So we've got um, Ollie Smart, which is their blend of like cassava root fiber, chicory root, um, artichoke inulin, nopal cactus, marshmallow root, all these things. And then we've got- I love chicory in my coffee. Yeah, that's good stuff. But they got a kudzu even. <laughs> There's now I thought kudzu is, a, is like a weed that just grows wild in the South, but- <laughs> and it's got uh, stevia yeah. and Himalayan pink salt mm -hmm. and extract. And it does have actual juice though. It's got yeah. the lime Which is and really good. quince juice. Now we've done a few Olipop and I think it's pretty good. Yeah, it's you pretty know? good. I've actually like tried some just on my own, just picking them up at Target and I'm usually impressed. And we're not gonna be able to tell you if like the prebiotic and all that kind of stuff is working. We're just gonna tell you, look, if it's, if it tastes good, right? Yeah. Because uh, let's face it, for the last 20 years, the consumption of soda has gone down. Mm -hmm. And it's nice for those of us who who still love soda, yeah. but don't really drink it often, have an alternative, right? Yeah, exactly. And guys, if you're new to our channel, basically, we review every day grocery items. So before you spend your hard-earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. You're smiling, what does that mean? It smells very pleasant and it does, it does. not burn my nose. It smells like ginger. Yeah, but but not like the spicy ginger. It smells like a sweet ginger. Yeah, it smells really good. Yeah. Let's, let's go. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right guys, welcome back to our rating system. Thumbs up right again, thumbs up or not. So for me, this is a thumbs down. This thing, it smells like ginger. Smells really good. Taste, it's very liquidy. Love the carbonation level. I just think that it's it's bitter. <laughs> yeah, I don't really care for it. Uh, it's not like extremely. I just think that um, to drink this whole can, would I find it refreshing? Would I, would I enjoy it? No, I would not. It would be like a chore. I, you would have to force me to drink all of this. Wow. Yeah, and it's really a shame because I think some of their other products are really good. I think the, the, the cola one day, I think mm -hmm. this is the one that has the cola, right? Yeah. That was really good. Vintage cola, I think so yeah, it's called. Yeah, I think that was really good. Um, this thing, I know it's good for you, but I just can't, I the thought of like drinking all of this, no. Um, it smells good though, so thumbs down. If you like what we're doing here, please consider sending us super thanks. It helps us continue to provide more amazing content. Alrighty, well, um, for me, this one's going to be a thumbs up and I'll just go ahead and hang on to this. Please do. Please I'm gonna do. drink the whole rest of this. Please do. I can't, like, I can't believe that this is so good. Like, listen, if you are the type of person where you like a ginger ale, ginger beer kind of thing, but you don't love it whenever it like burns your throat and burns your nose. I do, I, I love that. I yeah. don't, I don't love the burn. I can handle it sometimes. I'm used to it now, but I don't love the burn. This, there's no burn, no ginger burn at all whatsoever. And to me, I don't detect any bitterness. It tasted to me like a mixture of ginger ale and cream soda. Like it had this creamy flavor to it. I thought it was just amazing. I can't believe it. Like I was thinking to myself, like I need to go to Target and like buy a case of this. You know what? It's so good. Since I'm on a on the hate train, can I also tell you something that bugs the hell out of me about this? What? I hate the green. I hate you the hate gr the green? I hate the green. I hate the green that they went with. I think it needs to be a darker green. It it just to me it, it it's um. I don't like it, it's off-putting. Well, I, yeah. I think that you are correct. You're just hating right now. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, I think saying. it's fine. I, I actually really like their packaging. I like that each one is kind of like monotone in the same color family. So that's fine by me. Now this, it did taste like ginger, 
And it also had kind of a, in addition to the, the creamy, like cream soda kind of flavor, it almost tasted a little bit like marshmallow, like the candy marshmallow. It says that there's marshmallow like root or something in here. I don't know if that makes a difference, but like it does kind of have that flavor too. Like to me, number one, I'm shocked that there's only five grams of sugar and it's only 50 calories because this, I felt like it was a really, really good level of sweetness. Like it was really enjoyable, very drinkable. Uh, I think this is probably my favorite Olipop so far. To sum it up, thumbs up, thumbs down. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.